What do you mean you don't want to open? Stupid door! Oh, okay, I'll, I'll go sleep. Fine. There we go. Open door. <clears throat> I mean, yeah. Hello, everyone. This is TTH, and uh, this is the fifteenth episode of my Let's Play series. And it's been way too long since the previous episode. Yes, I know. If I've said that the previous episode as well. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that. But really, um. The reason for this is that, <laughs> yeah, uh, the reason for this is that uh, I've been trying to do something, uh, some sort of contraption uh, uh, for my world. Oh, hello! Don't you dare getting any closer, Mr. Creeper! Uh, I've been trying to do uh, a contraption or something, um, but turns out uh, it didn't work too well and uh, and uh, yeah, so this demotivated me, and uh, this is why I didn't do much progress since last time. But yeah, um, so uh, at least I can tell you what I've done since the previous episode uh, down here. I mean, in the ravine. Um, first thing. Uh, oh, by the way, I've put uh, smooth lighting on. Uh, this is the first time I've done this in my series, but don't ask why I didn't uh, in the first place. Um, oh, whatever. Uh, this is supposed to be uh, my iron uh, deposit, you know, for so the iron the iron golems are supposed to fall here, and they will. Yeah, this speaks for itself. They get killed, and uh, for now they still uh, there's still no uh, no uh, proper way to bring the items up. But I'm planning to use uh, minecarts uh, for this, and uh, the idea is that I will have in one side uh, the iron ingots while on the other side will be uh, the flowers. Although I don't think I will uh, need this much, this much space, but you never know. Uh, and uh, yeah, also uh, very basic stuff, uh, smelting room, just for smelting stuff. Um, put what you want to smelt here. Put the fuel here, and uh, the output is here. Um, and by the way, I've used uh, blaze rods for the, the the fuel, but I still I have some ideas, but I don't know how to properly um, implement them. And uh, this is also true for my other project up here. Um, I started doing uh, the granary I wanted to do to store all the food items, uh, I mean vegetable food items such as carrots and potatoes and all those uh, edible things. Well, wheat is not edible um, as is, but uh, you get the idea, you can make bread with it and uh, yeah. So this is the... Um, is supposed to be the granary. So, um, as I said, it's still... I don't know if I said it, but it's still unfinished. And um, this is one of the things which uh, kind of, uh, you know, blocked me. Um, uh, first of all, uh, I've already done a video about uh, this kind of, uh, you know, way to store items using minecarts. This is the first, second, and third. So this is where I uh, want to store all my food items. Um, 
and that would be in such a way that would uh, allow you know uh, I don't know well uh, my idea is much more, much more complicated than that because I want to bring the food items from directly from the you know the farm down here uh, and bring them over there and I want uh, this granary to sort those items um, but right now I'm not sure if I'm doing the thing uh, properly uh, right for the moment it still cannot it, it will not sort anything uh, it's just uh, independent it will not uh, I mean uh, this the circuit f circuit from this train track uh, is not connected to anything the I don't know if what I just said made sense, but I don't think it did to you guys. At least it does for me, hopefully. Um, yeah, that's awkward, but... Uh, <laughs> so, since this is way too complicated um, to do in a short amount of time, this is not what we are going to do today, because... Well, yeah. By the way... Uh, nothing. Nothing, <laughs> yeah. Um, what we are going to do today is that village thing, that uh, suspended dome. Suspended. It's not even suspended, it's floating. Um, so, yeah, this is where we are going to go. But first, there's something I found. Um, I found a, a witch hat, you know, uh, to... Wait, where am I going? That's, that's an error I shot through the, the portal. But, uh, I found a witch hut and um, must be over here, I think. No, must be over there. Uh, and the nice thing with this one is that it's not so. There's not much, uh, you know, space to lit around it. Of course, there are all those caves and stuff, but. Uh, Mostly, uh, there's mostly water around this place, which is pretty nice because, well, yeah, you want to, uh, if you want your witch farm, uh, as I'm planning to do a witch farm, if you want your witch farm to be effective, you need to have as little spawning spaces uh, for other mobs. Um, so so all the the, the spawning uh, uh, spots or I mean I don't know how to say it but you you can have you can only have so many mobs uh, active at the same time uh, in uh, the chunks around you um, so you want them to be all witches so you can have uh, their drops but. Well, I won't explain this thing because I'm terrible at that and this is going to be for another episode. Probably in a year or two or something. Yeah, shut up, shut up, that guy. Um, so, uh, blah, 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 yeah. So, as a reminder, uh, the way I get into the, the, the dome thing is through the nether, through a portal through this one, this portal. So, because there's no way other than the netherrack uh, line I've made to bring the uh, call them again, the villagers up or justificates, if you will, uh, there's no other way than that. And uh, yeah, so um, we are inside the dome, as you can see. Uh, we still have the villagers, so that's good. And apparently the world doesn't want to load. Or maybe it does. You know? Mm. Yeah, whatever. Um, so, I thought we should do something a bit more easy for today. Um, doing something more cosmetical rather than uh, technical. Even though I'm terrible at both, though. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. You know, 
I've never really looked at uh, this mountain from this place. I mean, yeah. Uh, and now I think I should do something like using this area uh, as a plateau for doing the the actual base or the over the surface base uh, and uh, connect it with uh, train tracks to the ravine base or something. But for now, we will just do some random stuff with those guys. Um, so I've brought uh, materials. Um, I think I need more smooth stone. Yeah, I'm gonna need that. And uh, then we will start building stuff. But we will have to plan it a bit. Oh, hello. Robith. I don't have these. Sorry. Uh, can you leave? Um, so, as I said, we will have to plan this thing a bit. Uh, since the... This is not... A can you leave, mister? Uh, no, seriously, that's creepy, mister. Um, so, since this thing is quite small, uh, it would be a bit more easy to plan stuff ahead. Um, I mean, for doing a village or something. Don't you dare getting any closer to me again! Damn guy! Some thanks, I swear. Uh, yeah. So, I went a little bit ahead and uh, started building this thing. Uh, this is supposed to be my way in and out. Uh, call that thing whatever you want. Uh, uh, don't know. A fountain or something. But The point is that... Uh, I can get in, but those guys cannot, because they don't have the AI for that. Unlike me, who has the AI for that one. No, I don't. Uh, whatever. So, um, yeah, I needed to do that first, because um, the city, or the village, I should say, uh, is planned to connect to the central uh fountain thing uh, so we could have a pathway pathway this way and uh, the idea is that we could also have some sort of um, you know a hill or something uh, to make this a bit less flat because yeah even if it even if this is supposed to be a floating uh, dome or something uh, which is supposed to be a, a safe heaven from the evil genius who lives in there, despite the fact this dome was built by the same evil genius. I've lost track of what I was going to say. <laughs> um, but whatever, uh, we're going to do some stuff in there, but for now, um, this is more or less an update episode. Um, I talked about uh, planning this stuff, but uh, actually I will do that for the next episode and uh, the construction of this village will probably take a few episodes, so... but hopefully uh, this episode being shorter means that uh, the next one will be easier to make, uh, as they will also be shorter. Um, but hopefully, in the end, I will be able to publish uh, episodes on a more consistent uh, schedule or schedule or something. I don't know how you guys say that thing. Damn you guys! Wait, what? Uh, yeah, whatever. So, until next time, guys. We will see again. And I will now proceed into shooting myself with my bow. Not this time. Goodbye!